Russian ban versus tens and millions of men on steroids in this world today. This is what makes the news. New York Times, December 9th, 2019, Russia banned from Olympics and global sports for four years over doping. Something else is in the news this year from medical journals that I read from the Endocrine Society, the Journal of Clinical Endocrinology and Metabolism, February of 2019, Dr. Anawalt, is the author, lifetime prevalence of anabolic androgenic steroid use is estimated to be one to 5% of the world population. So the message for this video today is to bring attention to that the media covers a fractional aspect of anabolic steroid use. Elite athletes, are cheating. It's not that I don't care about it. It's relevant. People shouldn't cheat. But the fact that there's never coverage, ever coverage in the mainstream media for the absolute epidemic and the numbers of men that are using steroids in this country, not to mention the world, it's just spinning. It's just absolutely tragic. I'm using my channel. I'm using my words and my voice to bring attention to healthcare providers that you need to pay attention to this. You need to work with men that are using steroids personally. These are not cheaters. They're doing it for personal reasons. And I'm conducting research with Wake Forest Medical Center, anabolic steroid research study. If you're a man and you're 18 years old or older and you've used any PEDS in the last five years, please consider taking our survey. I'd like to bring communication to the mainstream media that they're missing this. They're missing a huge epidemic of a failure to pay attention and to look at something so serious that men are using steroids widely open in our face in this world. And I don't want to discriminate on these men. I want these men to be helped. And that's my word today. So thank you everyone who follows me on this channel. I really appreciate it and the world appreciates it. And our words are stronger every single day. And healthcare providers are coming forward every day to me and working with me. We're getting in a better and better place every day to bring attention that people are using steroids and they need to be aware of what's going on related to their health consequences. Thank you so much. I really appreciate your support.